year. Thousands of Californians are reportedly getting letters saying their current insurance policies are being canceled under Obamacare. David Bennett has one woman's story and explains why the old policies don't comply with the new federal health care law. Lynn Brown from Elk Grove recently got an email from her health insurance company telling her it's canceling her current policy. It says that because of the requirements of the new laws, we can no longer offer your current individual health benefit plan. Brown says her insurer, Anthem Blue Cross, is offering a new policy, but one which will cost more than twice as much as the $159 a month she has been paying. My new premiums look like they're going to be anywhere from $350 to $450 a month. In the past couple of months, HealthNet has sent out 75,000 such notifications, Blue Shield of California, 119,000, and Kaiser Permanente, 160,000. They apply to individual policies purchased since the Affordable Care Act was signed in 2010. Consumer advocates say in some cases these were junk policies that didn't cost much, but didn't cover much either. Here in California, we certainly have seen plans that, you know, cover doctors but not hospitals, hospitals but not doctors, that covered your first day of hospitalization but not your second. Now, under the new law, all plans will have to include at least 10 basic services, such as prescription drugs, mental health services, and maternity care. Insurers say to get more, you'll pay more. The realities of, it, of the new law mean there are a lot of benefits, a lot more people will have access, but in some cases some people will have to pay more and some will have to pay less. Supporters of the law insist most people will end up paying less and that many will qualify for a subsidy to bring the cost down. These notifications that the insurance companies are sending out include costs only before any subsidies are factored in. To find out if you qualify for a subsidy, you can log on to the state's website, CoveredCA.com. Lynn Brown says she's already checked and does not qualify. By January, she'll need to pick one of her insurance company's options or shop around. In any case, she says the Affordable Care Act looks to be less affordable for her. And that was David Benick reporting.